up on the roof at Waterman. So again, we are on the third story, so that's the main street. Um, from a crane perspective, probably best right here. Um, I'm gonna get the, the total, this is a good way up. Might not, might have to use a bigger crane than our standard crane. Um, access to the roof. Just got a little telescoping ladder, roof hatch here. Um, a lot of uh, power lines coming in back here. Um, probably could get a, yeah, I'll check on um, the crane, but getting one back here, there's a few lines, one coming across right here, a few coming right here, you know, over there, and they're all over. It's gonna be difficult to get a crane up back here, especially with these trees. Uh, our best bet is gonna be the front. Um, unit, and please confirm this by flipping off um, power, but the unit is gonna be this one here. So we're gonna replace the electrical disconnect. Um, uh, chances are we're gonna flush the refrigerant lines. Um, uh, it is a two ton condenser. So we're gonna again mount a new electrical disconnect. We'll bring some new four by fours to set down. Uh, new filter dryer, but. Uh, it's gonna be a 13 sear with uh, quarter inch liquid lines. Can't go anything bigger than a 13. That's it. No, oh, again, one other thing. Yeah, I wanna reiterate, confirm it is this front unit. That's what the service techs told me. They didn't mark it. They weren't 100% confident. Uh, or they were pretty confident it was the one closest to the street, um, but I just, please verify that.